Hello everybody, welcome back to my Mass Effect Andromeda playthrough. So I uh, opened up the map so I can mark those uh, missions here. And then I thought, I'm going to zoom out and see what I can find. There's a lot of dots on my map to go to. Anyways, I'm going to focus on the ones that are in, in this little settlement right here first. Beginning with having to scan scavengers. Got a problem with that? Here, no. Did I hear you talking about the remnant? Dunno. You an mm. eavesdropping snake. Been breaking it down to sell. Could make a killing from the pieces. Uh, Ryder? You should check that out. Okay. For sure. Oh, wait. I just want to know what you're on about. So I gotta scan you. I'm assuming that I sh shouldn't be seen scanning you by you. Got it. I'll add it to my data banks. Brain chemical imbalance. Hmm. Is it something to do with the place, or are you guys being drugged, and are you being drugged willingly, or I don't know. Let's see. I guess we'll find out. Yeah. Hello, Twig. We got a big hey, you. Interesting you name. Wade, you're Nexus. What the hell do you want? What are you recruiting for? The Drifters. Meanest, richest gang on Eladin. Led by Big Tehran himself. We got a base, mm -hmm. plenty of guns, and the best scrap sites this side of Ataraxia. You ever get on the initiative's bad side? You should join up. Tell him to accent you. You're nice. You're Your not name like is Nexus. It's the name they gave me when I joined up. We all get one. They saw me use my biotics to snap a Solarian's back. Like a twig, they said. So now they use me for recruiting. I show off my powers. And the scavengers come running for protection. Works like a charm. Uh... That's terrible yeah, recruitment tactic. Big, big Terran is the deadliest guy on Eladin. I heard he killed two Krogan with his bare hands. Mm. Two Krogan? I don't know if I believe that. That's what he said. Well, it's what I heard he said. I've never actually met Big Terran. He stays pretty secluded. Says every gang leader on the dunes wants him dead. Most of us don't even know what he looks like. Do all the scavengers here form gangs? The smart ones do. Eladin is a rough place. You don't survive unless you group up. So you have another Reyes or it is Reyes, to be honest. They don't mm. last long. After mm. a couple of weeks on the dunes, they either come crawling back or they bite the dust. That's my bet, anyway. You guys out there. Here's hoping you do. Someone similar or... Well, you are living on a desert planet. Each one of you. See if I'm wrong. That one didn't work. Try someone else. Fascinating. Krogan too, huh? What is this? Not all of them. Just the one. What the heck? Ryder, you know how to go upstairs. I'm pretty sure you do. Alright, Mr. Reed. You're gonna be scanned. Wow. Be careful around that one, Ryder. Fascinating. Is he on the roof? Yes. I mean, it could be a she. Red, it's a he. Thanks, Ryder. That should be enough. I'll analyze this and let you know what I find. All right. All right, map. There's still one more here. Speak with Baloney, y'all. Hello, Valonia. 
Let me see. Meet again. So far. I'm impressed. I haven't even left this settlement. There's not much to be impressed about yet. Got info on someone named Isabel Halsey? What am I? Your personal database? Pretty please. Come on, you're the only one here who doesn't want to kill me. Just help me out. Fine, fine. I I've never met her, but I heard a few scavengers talking. Mention a cave out in the dunes. Something about Isabel's time being limited. This is the nav point. Just watch out. That's a bad area. All of Elodin is a bad area. Good point. All Take right. it easy. Always do. All right. I'm gonna go talk with this guy. I need my nomad. Aha. There's the spot where you, you <sighs> made it. Get out of my face. No. I won't get out of your face. You remember now, man. My concerns have been added to your. So, Eladin, charming so far. What do we got besides the sand? The remnant monolith suggests this was indeed supposed to be a golden world. It also suggests the presence of a vault. Additionally, here is the large derelict remnant ship that we saw as we landed. Hopefully abandoned. Scans indicate it is not. The site is active with scavengers and remnant bots. Here, scavengers have taken over an abandoned camp between the two. In this direction, located in one of the planet's sinkholes, is New Tachanka, the Krogan colony. Sinkholes. Sounds fun. Not really. Elodin is tidily locked to its sister moon and that gas giant above. This side of the moon never cools. Getting trapped in a sinkhole without shelter would mean certain death, as one's blood would boil in 75 seconds. Go. Oh. And on that cheery note, let's head for the climate-controlled paradise of the Nomad. Someone earlier claimed that sinkholes would... The Turians falling into the first contact war. Which war? Sorry, kid. I know that was a big deal for humans, but honestly, I've had indigestion last longer. All right. Anyways, someone earlier was claiming that sinkholes would help cool them down. I got a bad, very wrong interpretation of it. And now I'm looking at this one there, it's a lot of steam coming up. Or that could be caused by you know, either it being cooler than they get above air or hotter. Uh, do -do -do. Oh, there's a mining field over here. Yee! Pathfinder, this area is iron. resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Ryder, are those scavengers dismantling the remnant tech? Is that a problem? It is if they get their hands on a remnant core. It could become unstable and attract a scourge. How do we stop it? Pathfinder, I could modify your Omni tool to disable the cores and prevent them from reacting. Do it. Let's go fix this. All right. Keep on busy, Liam. Come on. 
deactivate. Gotcha. Reload. Another one up here. Oop. Come on. Ryder, jump! Systems are failing, Pathfinder. Why am I still getting hurt? Oh, because I'm out of life support. Where's my nomad? Where's my nomad? I need my nomad. I need my nomad. I could have modified your bonding tool to disable the calls and prevent them from reacting. Do it. Let's go fix this. Come on. Come on. Come on. Recharge cloak. Go back to I'll go back to no Matt. I'll I'm going to drive over to the other one. And get my freaking There it is. There we go. Pathfinder, I detect scavenger interference at additional remnant sites. Never make it easy for me. Let's go to those other sites. Excuse me, pardon me, don't mind me. All right, continuing on. Forget staying and fighting, jeez. Only life support is at risk, and there's no nearby way to replenish it. It's going to go to the greenhouse. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I'm not too direct. I've been around. I'm fourteen hundred and something. Two years or two decades. It's the same to me. Hmm. There's a difference between experience and out of touch. Yep. You're not as invested when young shits die. Look, I'm sure you're worth knowing, but all I see is a skull. Outlaw's got something rigged up over there. Let's do this! How about it's not yet? Glad still hasn't forgiven the Nexus, huh? Can't say I blame them. It's amazing they managed to set up any kind of working colony on this hellscape. We'll take that as a compliment. New Tachanka coming up. Ah. Uh, something is Mining shooting us. Added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Must be those outcasts over there. Hello, Krogan. No way this colony will make it. Come on, you have nowhere to go. Heard Sloan and Kadara is hiring. Oh, they're discouraged. You can see it. Hello, Krogan. Look out. Are within acceptable limits. Just Sam. I want to talk to the Krogan. Look no out. Outsiders. Speak with me. Human pathfinder. Drac. It's been a while. Jorgal Strux sent me. I'm supposed to talk with Morda. So now Strux is friends with the Nexus. Traitor. They mm. Got it, Greg. I'm not here to step on any toes. I can help you guys out. You assume we need help. Hey, you guys did your job. Now stand down and let them in. But, Drag, didn't I tell you to shut up? I'll spread the word so Mordar knows you're here. Good. Life support is stable. Seriously, guys? 
you you're not making things look good for Morda right now. You know that, right? Pathfinder must think she's pretty tough to just stroll in here. I wonder how long she'd last in a real fight. Subtle guys, real subtle. You want to test me? You want to try it out, man? I'll headbutt you all day. Just like Shepard. I do what I'm Shepard. Saw the worm bust straight through an old ship. Not a scratch on it. Some think it's invincible. Doubt it. Not too broken. It's probably like a thresher mall, right? Soft squishy human like you should probably steer clear of the wildlife out there. You said not as squishy as you think. Not a worm. The worm. Huge. Invincible. You can't miss it. It pops out of the dunes from time to time. Plows down everything in its path. Do I have to worry about it attacking? As far as we can tell, it doesn't care about us one way or the other. Just stay out of its way. It'll barrel right through you, tear you to pieces. Thanks for the heads up. Alright. <laughs> I'll take that. <clears throat> terminal with Dr. O'Kear's data was right next to the scrubbed ones. Don't worry, Dr. Gunnar. I'll track it down. What's wrong, guys? Uh, hello. I, I noticed you were listening. Uh, is it because you're a fan of the Krogan genius, Dr. O'Kear? I'm frantic because a terminal with all his research was accidentally sold to a junker. Um, no. Maybe. What was on it? His work regarding Krogan physiology and the genophage was advanced. I was his protege. Or, I was acquainted with his protege. <laughs> anyway, it's encrypted. But it would be bad if it fell into the wrong hands. I can give you a nav point and the name of the scavenger I accidentally sold it to. You talk about Dr. O'Kear like I should know who that is. Dr. O'Kear was on the leading edge of Krogan genetics, and possibly curing the genophage. And not using the slow genetic mutation approach the initiative has invested in. I have, I have a collection of his research. I hope to cure the genophage in the colony. Send me the nav point and the terminal identification. Done. I hope it's still on the planet. The Junker was aggressive. Don't worry, I'll find it. Before I leave Adela, then I will find it. Yes, real genuine bear jerky. Just like your battle master used to make. Here you get the it's a kind of jerky you can put between your lip gum during a fight, and the smell of blood mixes with a taste of salt and sends you into blood rage that much faster. We'll be taking offers all week. Serious and quarters only. Special parts isn't worth paying for expensive repairs on. They've got a custom microfiber catering. Several hundred years of experience getting old guns firing again. Maybe you need a chemical spine. Augmentation on the stock. Blah, blah, blah. Advertisements. Well, it tastes like much at first. It was kind of sweet. But then they burned the back of my mouth after it as well. I need more. Ginger. <laughs> Ginger's good for upset stomachs, too. Nutmeg. Never really had nutmeg. Cloves. Cinnamon. I love cinnamon. Cinnamon is the best. Don't, don't eat it straight up by itself though. Just don't. Cinnamon is amazing. And so when I get hot chocolate, I'm gonna put cinnamon in it. All right. What are you guys up to? Should have known Morta would take over. She'll run this place into the ground. Bad karma naming it New Tachanka. Okay, that's where I gotta go for Drax. Come on over here. 
those scavengers are roasting out there. We're closing early tomorrow. Any reason? Did I say you could ask questions? You're a lackey, not a partner. You're lucky I'm nicer than your last assistant. You have enough scars, old man. Well, look at that. Not one of those damn scavengers, are you? I'm with the Andromeda Initiative. That's worse. Look, you want to buy, talk to my seller. I hired him so I don't have to deal with the customers. The Nexus is paradise compared to this. You don't want to go back? Even a little? So we can be your attack dogs again? Get treated like dirt until we finally fight back? This is no different than the rebellion back home. Only time we get respect is when we take it by force. We were stupid to think it would be any different here. You talk like you saw the rebellions. You can't be as old as Drac. What's that supposed to mean? I was born during the final year, just before the Turians hit us with the genophage. My father died in the fight on Canva. It took two dozen Turian guns to drop him. I'm glad he didn't live to see us riding in cargo on the Nexus like pets. Bet the scavengers are crawling all over the salvage you pick up. Not too bad. I picked my scrap out in anorexia, where squishies like you can't handle the heat. I don't get too close to the flop house. Scavengers gather there like insects. Can't defend my salvage against those numbers. Look at me. I was a warrior, but now I fight vermin over a junk heap. No. I should get moving. I'll be here. I feel kind of bad for him. Pathfinder, welcome. You don't welcome an alien into our colony, you ignorant child. Shut up, old man. Sorry about that. Don't mind him. Credits are credits, I say. About time someone around here is friendly. Just give him time. Prove you're one of the good ones. Now buy something before he starts yelling again. That that all you have? That that's looks that looks like a pretty good shotgun though. I'll buy it. You guys saying anything? You mean the plant? Or me? Mm. What are you looking at? Ah. Barter station. Gently used ship parts, gear, weapons, food. Gently use food? Hey, I sample all my wares to ensure top quality. <laughs> Gently used food. <laughs> That's great. Been too long since I had to use a rifle. Hello, Rourke. Nice Pathway. halo you got going on? Sometimes. Have you met one named Lietta? I don't think so. Why? She was a salvager. Made runs to Elodin all the time. When she landed, she would always stop here first. We climbed the dunes together, took in the view, talked for hours. Lietta had a hard time in this heat, so I said I'd make her a cryo bracelet. That was thoughtful. I bet she appreciated that. I never got the chance to give it to her. Oh. One day, she just stopped coming. I don't know where she is, if I'll ever see her again. You think something happened to her? She could have taken a new job. Maybe she was sick of Elodin. But if there's even a chance she ran into trouble, I can't stand not knowing. Tell me more about Lietta. She's adventurous, optimistic. Her jokes could make a Groban blush. In a place like this, she stood out. I think she'd stand out anywhere. I could track her down for you, make sure she's okay. Salvager at the Paradise might know something. I would like that. If you find her, will you give her the cryo bracelet? Tell her she can use it to visit me again. Thank you, Pathfinder. You seem different from the other Krogan. I like this Krogan. <sighs> My father called me a Salarian in a Krogan body. It's supposed to be an insult. Joke's on him, though. I like Salarians. What are you doing up here? Looking. 
back home, we didn't have time to just stop and look. Is life that different here? It was all about survival. Here, we don't have to fight so hard. Of course, the older ones still think they have to fight. Maybe it's just in their blood. They'll come around. Sounds like Helios was an easy choice for you. New galaxy, new life. Not interested in being a merc like my father, or battling it out on Tachanka. I almost didn't want to be packed into cryo for the journey. Wanted to see the whole thing. Would have been pretty lonely. Never been bothered by loneliness. The views would have been worth it. I should get going. Yeah. If I was in the Mass Effect universe, and I was Krogan, or an Asari who lived long like you, I would have joined you just so you wouldn't be alone. Plus, those views probably were amazing. Would have been amazing. These wear helmets. Don't use welding torches for tattoos unless you're sure it's something you want on your skin forever. Quit stealing supplies. Only add guns to things the plans say should have guns on them. <laughs> Don't fire your guns into the air in celebration unless you shout that you're going to do so beforehand. <laughs> uh. <laughs> um, I don't really want to read all of that. I will probably read all of that if it's true, but not right. You're about the Nexus wanting us back? <laughs> so the Squishies finally realize they're screwed out here. A lot more than oops, my bad, to scratch out what they did. No, oh, it was mostly Spindler that did it. Spindler and Tan. You hear Garak and his team tried to fight the worm? Epic battle. Got in a few good shots before it killed a lot of them. Dumb bastards. Always had more quads than brains. If you had out worm hunting, let me know. I'll plan your funeral. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll take care of that worm. Is anybody out here, or is this the exit to the colony? I think that's the exit to the colony. Oh wait, hello people. What's up? Better to live for myself than to see this place go the same way as Tachanka. Don't be stupid. Morta will find her way. Will she? I'm a little iffy on her, what I've heard so far. But we'll find out. In the meantime, I'm going to call... Jump, Ryder, jump! Oh, hello, Jumpy Krogan. Just enjoying the view? Alright. Nothing to say. I'm going to leave this episode off here, and I will go down and talk with, again, Drax's loyalty mission next episode. In the meantime, though, thank you guys all so much for watching. Like and subscribe down below if you want to see more. Let me know what you think in the comment section, and as always, keep it real and spread the love. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!